Welcome back to World Rally Sport Valley. How are you doing on this Tuesday? We are doing an AEW Dark Elevation review from last night. Good show. There was a couple of bangers, I'll tell you that. Emi Sakura v Athena. What a banger, as they call it. Great match. Let's go over some of the matches. We'll move up. Yeah, on the show. Okay then, guys, here we go. Let's start with Julia Hart. Looking all weird and scary. She had a face mask on, new hairstyle, all curly there, looking all no reaction whatsoever. Weird. She had a match for Tiara James, making her AEW debut. So um, I think we knew who was going to win this one. Julia Hart from House of Black. She got the win with the Heartless submission. So a win there for Julia Hart over Tiara James. Then we had a Hikaru Shida v Christina Marie. Why Hikaru Shida isn't on Dynamite or anything and just on Dark every week is ridiculous. Tony Khan, hope you're listening. Come on now, she's really good. Hikaru Shida got the win, of course, with that spinning kick to the head of Christina Marie. One, two, three. See you later, Christina Marie. Bye bye for her. A lot of women's matches on the show t uh, last night. Quite good. This match was awesome. Emi Sakura from Japan v Athena. Well, what a match. Quite a long match as well. And uh, in the end, lots of chops in the match. Big chops. And in the end, Athena top rope. I'll call it the Eclipse. Oh, my God. Bang right on Emi Sakura. One, two, three. And Athena got the win. She's good, isn't she, Athena? A.K.A. Ember Moon. Good stuff. John Silver, he had a match v Ryan Nemeth. Looks like Dolph Ziggler, but younger mini version. Dolph Ziggler's brother, of course. So John Silver got the win here with this spin doctor, where he spins him around and slams him to the canvas. One, two, three. Johnny Hungy. Johnny Silver from the Dark Order got the win. And uh, we'll finish off the main event, which was a Nick Camarato and Aaron Solo with uh, QT Marshall. Man, I can't stand that guy. He's annoying, isn't he? Oh, God, and man. He's annoying. That's what I'll say. Anyway, they had a match versus Butcher and the Blades with the lovely the Bunny Blades wife in real life. So the bunny was dancing round there. And they're from Buffalo. That's where it was uh, filmed or taped in Buffalo.